Okay, first I'm going to show the four pound channel catfish. Then, mainly the reason I'm making this is to show the the different nets that I put together. But this catfish I got last night. Now here are the nets. Back up a little bit. That longest one is my brand new shad net. And I wrote these down. The, that It's 10 foot overall length. That's a brand new shad net. I went over the dam just now and got a bunch of shad but they're all small ones and that next one is the end of my old shad net but i put it on the uh four and a half foot handle that used to be on my big fish net which was way too short but i can use that shad net or bait net whichever way you want to think of it to dip brim out of my uh, fish baskets with and the next one is just a regular store-bought net uh, for big fish with a five foot handle I got too close but then the new one I stole the shad net handle and it's got a five foot handle and then the overall length is ten foot and that's the one that's big enough to reach off my fishing pier get over here and pick that one up yep, I'll lay it down that's better you can see it's got the four foot uh, big net on it. And like I said, the overall length on it now is uh, seven foot, and that's enough to reach off the side of my fishing pier. Caught that catfish on little shad. I got a bunch more. Most of them I've kept the water cold to keep them fresh, and I'm going to put them in the freezer anyway. But you can see the size of them. Oops. There's another bucket of them. I may use some of the live ones tonight, but mainly I got these to freeze. And the water is cold, so they won't be they won't be spoiled when I thaw them out. Well, they won't stink. Those are sandwich bags. I'm gonna put all the shad in little sandwich bags and then put them in that tide box to put them in the freezer so I don't get them mixed up with my deer meat and accidentally eat them okay here's a footnote here's a replacement net it's actually a salmon net but it's four foot deep and so I like it for the real big catfish I'm gonna put it on a uh, another hoop and then a guy down the street he's got a 10 foot handle so all together it'll be about 12 foot long and I'll be able to use it off my fishing pier but it's uh, this is the same net that you saw on the other one out there, same type of net, the salmon net.